Juan Pablo, welcome to Saints. You've arrived, so just tell me how you've settled in in the last couple of days. Thank you very much. Um, perfect. Uh, everyone was, he has been very nice, very helpful. So, yeah, just here for two days, but um, looking forward for what's coming. This is your first rugby job away from Argentina, so what are you most looking forward to about living in England? Yeah, I'm looking forward, most of all, for learning, learning from my teammates and coaches, and uh, really getting the most of this experience, you know, uh, playing the highest level of world rugby, and I'm uh, very happy to be here in, in Arhamda. You've only been here for a couple of days, but what have you most enjoyed so far about being at the Saints? Uh, the people are very nice, they are all... Uh, Tweeted me, giving me a welcome, and, and training here with this team is amazing, so I'm really enjoying it. You've literally just come back from Rio because you played for Argentina at the Olympics. That must have been a fantastic experience for you. Yeah, it was a great experience, you know, and we've been training a lot for that, and when we actually arrived, we were very prepared and focused on what we had to do, and of course, living in the village was great. You know, you, you're walking and you see Djokovic training in a tennis court and things like that are the best things of the Olympics. So it was great, a nice experience, but I was also looking forward to this. Who was the biggest name that you met whilst you were in the Olympic village? You mentioned Djokovic, were there other yeah. guys that you met? Yeah, I met uh, Rafa Nadal, I met Tony Parker, uh, Ginobili, and, well, and many athletes, but they're, they're the most popular one so yeah, I couldn't see Usain Bolt but I think he was in his room and didn't go out a lot. What did you most enjoy about being at the Olympics? I enjoy living and sharing things with uh, this, this kind of people you know we were drinking or having drinking uh, water or having fun all together with the Argentinian uh, teams you know uh, hockey, basketball, volleyball, handball and the relationship that you build and the, the things you have in common uh, really stands out and you talk a lot with them and you make a very good relationship with people that if it wasn't for the Olympics you, you wouldn't have met. Now that you've arrived in Northampton, what sort of things are you looking forward to doing in and around the town in your free time away from rugby? Um, no, most of all getting to you know the, the people, the place, you know, and really enjoying being in this excellent city. and. Um, move around comfortably with, without getting loose in my car and nothing, uh, it's very nice. 